dating as an autistic single mother is very challenging. Most of you know that I just got out of like a 10 year relationship and we were married and that was very challenging. Now that I've been single for over a year now, I learned that I don't know anything about dating. So since I was in a long-term relationship for so long, most of my adult life, I don't know how dating really works. First of all, I don't leave the house because I'm the full-time content creator. So how am I going to meet people? I'm not going to do online dating because I already hear crazy stories about that. Second of all, I have autistic kids, so I'm busy taking care of my autistic kids most of the time. Third of all, I have social anxiety, so I don't even go grocery shopping. I stay home, I order groceries from home, and let's just say a brave man approaches me and we exchange numbers. So now I have to tell him I'm autistic and I'm a single mother, okay? If that doesn't scare him off, great. Now I have to explain to him what autism is and how I'm probably different than most women. And then on top of that, I have to explain to this man that I have autistic kids. So they need a lot of my attention. You know, the challenges with that as well. And then on top of that, I don't know if you watch Love on the Spectrum, but I can relate to Danny a lot. We know what we like, okay? And if you don't like the same things as me, it's a no for me. So I have to find someone who has the same special interest as me. If I meet a man and he's like, ugh, I hate cats. I don't care who you are already. It's a no for me. I'm so sorry. If, if you don't like the same music as me, then what we're going to listen to together? Huh? If you don't like the same food as me, then what we're going to eat together? So basically, I have to find a man who is able to understand what autism is, accept me and my kids for our autism, have the same interests as me, be successful, is attractive, and likes cats. How am I gonna find that? I also have to find a man who's emotionally mature, who's emotionally intelligent, and is able to let me communicate my feelings without them taking it personal or having a heart attack when I tell them that something makes me feel uncomfortable or I feel uncomfortable, I have anxiety, for them not to get mad about it and support me instead. As an autistic woman, I need a lot of emotional support, reassurance. I also have to be with someone who's funny. Like if we're not laughing and we're not joking about the most immature jokes, then we won't get along either. I'm just gonna have resentment. And from my experience, most people do not know what autism is. You could explain it all day, every day, but unless you're with someone who is autistic for a long time or have a family member or read about it, like it's very hard to get the understanding of it. I, I would need to be with someone who takes my invisible disability serious and, um, you know, is patient with me. And I know people in my comments say, oh, you're gonna be single and miserable forever. First of all, who said I'm miserable? I've been thriving. 